He was one of the first on the scene of the deadly helicopter crash involving Outback Wrangler star Chris Willow Wilson. And today he avoided jail for destroying evidence at the crash site. He was Matt Wright's wingman and today the Outback Wrangler star himself backed his mate. Matt Wright, the Outback TV star, making a surprise low-key appearance in a supporting role for his wingman at Darwin Local Court. Mr Wright, are you here to support your friend today? In the high-risk, high-reward stakes of wrangling crocs in the Northern Territory... Successful mission, gentlemen! Star of the show, Matt Wright, surrounded himself with a trustworthy band of brothers. Blokes like wingman Michael Burbage, the one-time respected owner of a chopper fleet and skilled pilot. Burbage was one of the first to touch down at the crash site in remote West Arnhem Land alongside Matt Wright two years ago. The accident claimed the life of Wright's co-star Chris Wilson and left pilot Sebastian Robinson critically injured. They've got some fantastic memories of everything that we've done over the years, it's great, but I'd trade that in a heartbeat just to have Willow back. Michael Burbage made cameo appearances in Wright's global reality TV series, but his commitment to that supporting role has been under intense scrutiny since the fatal accident. Are you a puppet for Mr Wright? Burbage was charged with attempting to pervert the course of justice and destroying and fabricating evidence relating to the aftermath of the crash. Last December, Burbage sensationally pleaded guilty to destroying a mobile phone to prevent it being used as evidence. We pressed Burbage for an explanation, but the pilot's comms remained silent. Did Mr Wright tell you to destroy this evidence? In his defence, the court heard Burbage destroyed Chris Wilson's mobile phone because it contained information that could damage his friend's reputation. He also received shock support from Wilson's family in a written statement. They value the type of man he is and would like to express their support to him. They accept that Burbage made a mistake and will entrust the court to do what is right and fair. This afternoon, Burbage was convicted for his crime, but he managed to avoid doing jail time. He was fined $15,000 and walked free from Darwin Local Court. But it's here at Darwin's Supreme Court where the Outback Wrangler will be fighting for his freedom. This grand old building has locked up some household names over the years. And now it's Matt Wright whose fate will be decided from behind these historic doors. Wright's been charged with perverting the course of justice. Another six charges, including tampering with evidence and threatening Pilot Robinson, now a paraplegic, are yet to be heard. Wright denies any wrongdoing as he fights criminal and civil charges. A decade ago, a young Matt Wright starred in a territory work safety video. Now the watchdog is baring its teeth. It's charged Wright and his company, Hallibrook, with reckless conduct for operating unsafe aircraft. It claims Wright falsified the number of flight hours of his aircraft, putting the safety of pilots and passengers at risk. Doesn't get any better than this. Just Not that the out. Wrangler looked concerned on social media the day he was charged. That's 11. If found guilty, Wright personally faces being fined up to $1.2 million and five years in jail. I love you to the moon and back and I just want you to come home. Wilson's widow Danielle is also putting the heat on Wright, seeking to have the Wrangler's assets frozen, like his luxury top-end retreat, as she personally sues him over the death of her husband. Before that case is heard, another so-called supporting actor is due to be sentenced. Disgraced former top-end cop Neil Mellon also pleaded guilty to destroying evidence. Neil Mellon, have you rolled on Matt Wright, Mr Mellon? Have you rolled on Matt Wright? Mellon was present at the crash site alongside Wrangler Matt Wright and pilot Michael Burbage before air crash investigators arrived. 